Hey there, hi there, hello everyone, and welcome to another Narjan Reacts. In this, we're going to be reacting to The Dragon Prince Season 3, Episode 1. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. Also, quick uh, notification, or just to let you guys know, um, if I sound nasally, or I cough and stuff, or sniffle, um, I came down with a cold, so, yeah. Thankfully, it's not bad enough that it's preventing me from reacting to all this stuff, but it's definitely uh, there. So, um, yeah, anyway. <laughs> Soul Raging the Golden Dragon? Those are pretty birds. Long ago, Zadia. I just realized this voice talking right now. Is that Erevos? 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 The 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 uh Star Touch elf that Viren's communicating with? Because that voice sounds like his. And I'm just realizing now, does that mean he I mean, well, he does have the sparkling arms from the beginning of season one. Or the one that's opening the map and everything, and he also narrated that then. Which makes sense now. Okay. Reach in magic. And magic. Until the human nation attack. <laughs> Plot twist, this is Viren later on. That's a big dragon. I wanna know who this sorcerer was. Oh, we're getting... Wait, so... This dragon can speak? So I'm guessing this is an Arc Dragon. or Arcanum Dragon? Not Arcanum Dragon. Um, Arc... I forgot what you guys referred to, to them as, but they're, they're, stra they're dragons that are much more powerful than the average one, which um, I believe Zim is as well. So does that mean Zim will have a voice later on? <laughs> That'd be kind of cool. Is that why you summoned me here? So you could insult me? You Summon him. You just expect humans to go back to the way things were before we had met. Is that I see Viren's staff right there. At least from like the middle down. Isn't that's Viren's staff. Actually, no, that's Okay, remove the antlers and the skull in the front. That's Viren's staff. So Viren, how did you get this guy's staff? Or was this your father? Because I don't know how far back this is. Hmm. Now I'm curious about that. Back to a time when we were lesser beings. Caveman, ooga booga. Lesser beings. You, you are. are. And walk away. Okay, I mean, this dragon with its size and power, I'm sure it would have quite an ego. <laughs> I can't blame it for having one. Um, but yeah, obviously this mage or whatever the sorcerer. Uses dark magic a lot because we see with like um, with Claudia and uh, Viren that their hair kind of turns white when they use it. This guy is like permanent white, and it's like big streaks through his hair. So he obviously uses dark magic a lot. Lay it down. But He's gonna a gift. That would be rude. Who gave that to you? What's one of the great ones? Great ones. Who? Who's the great ones? You, or I will reduce it to ash. Whoa. You wouldn't. This is smogged. I would not ask this dragon you wouldn't, or I wouldn't dare him. Are you gonna suck in the magic from the Oh okay. Oh no, not the birdies, not the pretty birds. Oh, he turns back. Whoa. Okay, well, obviously Soul Regime survives this. Because if not, we wouldn't be seeing him now. If I'm guessing the sorcerer did. Oh, this is how he gets the scar on his face. Okay. And then you have the staff left over. Now, how does Viren get it? Oh, he blinds him? Does he drop it to the moonlight? The lake by the, um, oh my god, where, uh, what's her name? Miss Trickster. Elf. Interesting. Okay. So that's how he got blinded in the scar. That's how the staff, the staff's master owner became masterless. <laughs> wow, he did a big damage. Is there such a thing as an ordinary dragon? 
His name is Sol Ragum, the Ragum. Sun King. Come a symbol of rage and bitterness. Ooh. Okay, so an enormous anger. Interesting. I mean, he went from a dragon that honestly seemed pretty egotistical to then once he got injured, instead of taking that and being humbled and going, you know what? I learned not like he learned like to tone it down or back off. He now has taken that and become angry and bitter. He's gonna be a scary dragon to mess with. Three blind dragon is blocking our path to Zadia. What do we is do? is Calum gonna tame it? Simply for him? him. Seeing as you've just got your cute blow spell and my swords aren't fit. Cute to blow spell. Toothpicks. toothpicks. Wait, wait. What was freaking Zib's face there? <laughs> no. Wait, that goes by so fast. <laughs> okay, this isn't fair. I really want to see this face that Zib makes. Toothpicks. <laughs> Look at Zib's face. <laughs> <laughs> oh. We'll have to sneak past him. Callum, sneak 100? It's time for you to get your first lesson in the ways of an assassin. Nice. I, I mean, nice. Nice. <laughs> the of stealth. Well, he's blind, so we don't need to worry about his sense of sight. So, <laughs> smell and that hearing. Only two senses mm -hmm. need to fool. Hearing and smell. Well, if it gets to his sense of touch, we're in big trouble. Yeah, I wouldn't want to get near him. You're dead. Nice knowing you. Yeah. If you say so, mage. Mage. And abandon the fortress. That's a face of General. I don't think so. General. When the elves mount an attack. Am I gonna get to hear her voice in this episode? Is that a yawn or a roar? Is that your little roar? <laughs> Or is them. Calm you down. I've got you. So cute. Little Zim. You gotta hide in a backpack is what he's gotta do. Just don't make any cute puppy noises as you go by him. <laughs> Zim's face again. Just, yeah. No sneezing. This is gonna be a really bad time to have a cold. I don't think Callum can do that. The wind's gonna stop while you're in the middle of it. Red Zim, be quiet. Oh, Zim. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> run fast over here. He's gonna be like, uh-uh, I'm not going toward you over there. Oh. Yeah, run. <laughs> Jesus. What now? Try talking to him? He can hear. Oh, it's Ren. Ren. <laughs> Huzzah! You're alive. Oh, the beard. Where's Tubble? We're coming. Lord Viren has been arrested for treason. Right, she looks like she's not surprised. <laughs> we'll never make it. He'll just bite us in half or slam us with his tail. In half? So I think he'd swallow you whole. Burn him to death? Definitely out. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather not burn her death. Talk to him? Uh, looks like it's down to my least favorite course of action. Talking? Reason. Reasoning! <laughs> what are you doing? I am bowing, great dragon. You can't no, see that. I mean, why are you here? We have been traveling in the human kingdoms on the business of Zubeya, the dragon queen. We have oh, ask her name. your permission. The newborn dragon prince Azamondius. Why? You dare lie to me. Sniff him. The Sniff him. Why do you sound almost upset about it? I, here. I mean, what? Not upset that it was destroyed, but I mean, why does he almost sound upset, like, like defensive, like it should be destroyed? Like, what if, what if Regum was part of that? Maybe that's why Zim's freaking out. Oh, he's the dragon prince lives, and he's very cute. Is he's very cute. cute. There's a good boy. I was to pass so we can reunite the dragon prince with his mother. Are you gonna be bitter about this, or 
I will allow you and the Dragonling to pass back into Zadia. But what about Callum? Because a human is what did this to his face. His reaction to Callum, I think, is going to be different if he finds out about Callum. Oh, I, I don't know about this one. Um, okay, good. He's letting Zim and Rayla go by, but yeah, I don't know. A human. human. Yeah, that's what I thought. Rayla, getting Zim to Zadia is all that matters. Is he going to change his mind when he hears this? Dragon... No. There are two choices. You all die. Or just the wretched evil human. Oh, you're bitter as all can be, aren't you? He left his home and his family to save the egg. And he sacrificed I'll look at Callum's face. So Azimondius could be born. He's noble and true. When we met... Yes, fall for Rayla. He's smart and kind and brave and he's... You're gushing. My friend. My, my best friend. Best friend. <laughs> friend. Yes, hold on. Look, look at that face on Callum. Nah. Look at that little darky face on him. Nah, that that, uh, that was a moment he, I think, fell for Rayla. Or something sparked. I don't think I can do it without him. Sims. <laughs> Callum's face. I love their. Oh! Man, Rega was scary. Holy. Okay, I can't blame him in the sense of like dark magic. Yeah, it sucks the life out of living creatures and stuff. Yeah, I agree with that. Like, I don't agree with dark magic and everything, but Callum used it once and rejected it. Even though Regan wouldn't know that. But listen, man, we can talk about this. I think, or maybe that time's passed. We'll seal the breach forever. All right, something's gonna get in the way or stop them. I think. I'm sorry, Rayla, but if me dying is the only way for you and Zim to What's get across the sparkly eyes? Then it's time for me to face the end. Calm down. You're so dramatic. He use his fire breath yet. He can only do it every few minutes. He needs time to recharge. Oh my god, he's got a charge meter. Are you serious? <laughs> he's like a rail gun. Now you're sounding like Lou Jane. Wow, really? That Lou Jane, that's her name. Compliment. That wasn't a compliment. I could use Asper to blow my sense Oh, here we go with Callum's plans. Like oh my god, what is that like smolder look? <laughs> Callum. Smell triloquism. Uh, smell triloquism. Then smell -aquism. It's a stupid idea. Yeah, I agree. But there might be something to it. <laughs> Good enough. No, he won't. I'm faster than him. Mm -hmm. And besides, it's the only chance. She's more agile have. than you, Callum. I haven't bathed in two weeks. This should do the trick. I don't think you need to. Oh. Right. Right. What do you mean, right? <laughs> like that's a compliment. It's like, yeah, I didn't bathe in two weeks. How's that smell? <laughs> Awful. Here goes nothing. <laughs> Look at each other. Ah, yeah, there's all this development here. Oh, yeah. You gonna blush? Oh, I'm loving it. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm shipping it. <laughs> Something's gonna stop to them. The explosives on your command. Are the elves gonna hey. the sunfire elves? Oh. oh, I thought the rope snapped. Oh, it did snap. Okay, it's been compromised. Mm-hmm. Ah, are we gonna hear her? Are we gonna hear her? Are you gonna speak? Oh, please! I want you two to fight. Ding ding round to three. I, I'll do it. I'll do it myself. Well, that was a goodbye smile. She said the rest of us will. Is she gonna end up falling or something in the Sunfire Elf Captain or whatever general is gonna save her or something? Is this how we're gonna get those two to get closer? What are you gonna do, Callum? You're gonna you do your wind thing? He reminds me of Smog. Jesus. Well, you're gonna have to recharge now. 
Hi. Uh-oh. Uh... Whoa. Horsey, no! Ah, uh, the torch. Oh, well. I want that. Can you use a spark of a sword or metal to go and light them? Or is she gonna use the Sunfire Elf Sword? Oh, I got a brief snippet of her voice. A grunt. Fuck flame on? A horse. At least she saves the horse. Oh. Yeah, that'll do it. I was gonna say Amaya no, but I, I really doubt she's dead. Yeah. Where's Sunfire Elf? Oh. You gonna spare her, Amaya? Yeah, you're gonna help her. Why did you save me? Oh. You're okay after having rocks like that land on you, girl? Are they gonna fall on that orange? What are you? Make it fall on his head? He wants me to blow up on the dragon? <laughs> no. Aspero. Oh, the smell. Well, I mean, hey, smell. That that counts. Oh, his crest. <laughs> his, his crest thing. I wouldn't stand there. Relax, I'm only slightly singed. Good thinking, Miss Aspero. You two might want to go. Yeah, th that's hold him exactly. I'm about to say, stop celebrating. You can celebrate after. A Zim, <laughs> Zim. <laughs> Looking a little ashy there, Baron. Locks and chains in the five kingdoms to contain the threat. Okay, I have to ask this. Is that for, is she voiced by uh Rayla's VA? Because that sounds like a like older non Scottish or Irish accent, Rayla. Permanently. Yeah, that sounds like Rayla's VA. Oh, it's this one. Riding on his panther. Or Panther. They're cool. Thanks, Panther. It's like Baloo and Bagheera combined. The crown. This is so weird having like a 12 year old be crown. Even though I know that that's like un not uncommon in like time period. Even Bates like, <laughs> a lot of pressure. All right, bring on the art. All right, so that's, I'm guessing that's, yeah, that's definitely Amaya being escorted by two of the Sunfire Elves. There's that Sorcerer Mage. At least we know what happened to him. He got scorched. There's Regum. Really? Rayla with the scarf and she's blushing is she? Okay. Aw, Ezrin's looking at I'm, I'm guessing Ezrin's looking at a photo of him, Callum, Harrow, and their mom. It's him standing underneath Regum. <laughs> I love how Zim was so scared of Regum, and then once Regum is like stuck, it's like, heh, <laughs> kicks dirt at him. It's like, you were a chicken. <laughs> you were terrified of Regum, Zim. Are we gonna have a Regum and Zim fight at some point where, when Zim's older? But anyway, all right, uh, let me go ahead and get into my thoughts. All right, so. My thoughts for that episode. Uh, for the first episode of the new season, um, or season three, I should say, not new season. Uh, for season three, uh, I was good. Um, Soul Regum, um, I was hoping was going to be more like benevolent or more. Uh, yeah, I guess benevolent would be the word, but um, it makes sense that he like hates dark magic and humans that use dark magic, and especially what he dealt with with that mage sorcerer even though it seems like regum also had like a pretty big ego he almost reminds me of smog with the ego but less hatred of all humans 
overall, like, he even made a deal with that sorcerer and was like, if you give up dark magic, I won't hurt any of you, kind of thing. But because the sorcerer didn't go with it, um, uh, Regan was going to go through with killing all the humans. So it's like, uh, he's not full on, like, bad like Smog, where Smog just didn't care and, like, killing, you know, everything and anything, pretty much. Um, he had, like, his reasonings in a way. Um, like, I understand where he's coming from, like, especially when he, like, smelled the dark magic on Callum. It's like, a, oh, I know this stuff, and, uh, it's not good, and you humans using it are always, uh, bad juju. So, <laughs> um, so, I, but I wonder if he's gonna appear again later on. Like, maybe Callum's able to, like, talk to him or, like, show that he's not, like, any other human kind of thing. It'd be interesting. Um, also, yeah, Raylum development. I forget, is that their ship name? I'm pretty sure it is but we got that more development so we got callum i think moving on from his crush or feelings for claudia and starting to develop feelings for rayla um which yay <laughs> i hope it doesn't go too fast i hope they don't like get together within like the middle of the season or something i hope it's more of a build up longer like they both kind of like i want to see them be like little flustered dorks around each other like more like you know like the where they look at each other it's just like oh and it's like that like that i always love that stuff um, but yeah, I mean, and then we also saw, got to see more of the Sunfire Elf a little bit, not a ton, a little bit. Um, uh, but yeah, it was mainly a focus on, honestly, of Soul Regum, um, kind of that sorcerer mage guy, um, and what the whole deal with that was and how Regum got a scar, uh, or got blinded. Um... Also, the staff that Viren has. Still care. They didn't show how Viren has gotten it, but we saw at least where it came from, which was definitely that sorcerer. Um, but other than that, yeah, I wasn't really focused on too. No, nah. I mean, yeah, I got the. You got a Maya. You got the. They kind of touched on Viren briefly. So, um, yeah, overall a good first episode for the season three. Um, plot was great, I would say. Characters were great. Animation good, and the music was good. So, yeah. Um, those are my thoughts for this episode. I hope you enjoy this reaction. If you like early access to my full on edit reactions, go join my Patreon. Link will be over about here in the cor far corner. Uh, but yeah, hope you have a wonderful morning, after night, and keep running bright. See ya!